Thanks for joining us on this edition of the Council Recap. Council met Monday, March 2nd, 5.30 in the Council Chambers. First item of business was Mayor Steam reading a proclamation for March 9th as Colorectal Cancer Awareness Day to raise uh, awareness in regards to uh, cancer that claims the second most people of any other cancer, so we wanted to do that. Uh, next item of business, we moved on and approved uh, bids for our annual asphalt supply. They had two bids for that. Low bid went to the Ulan Brothers. Um, that supplies our maintenance of our uh, local roads, but not a part of our road projects. Uh, moving on, we accepted a donation to the City of Austin. We also approved an airport lease with Patricia Moore, some farmland out by our airport. Uh, that uh, property was for a five-year period at $225 an acre. <clears throat> this uh, next item of business was for our Turtle Creek 2 Sanitary Sewer Extension Project. This is north of I-90 on the west side of town. Um, we've got a state um, PSIG grant that helps provide 80% of the eligible expenses, a $1.9 million project to extend sewer to homeowners in that area and, de and deal with failing septics in that area. Um, residents are assessed a charge of $16,700 uh, to connect to the system and represents their cost share of the project. Um, council approved that project moving forward. We waited quite a long time to get those uh, state awards on that project, but finally came through and moving forward, so we're happy about that. We had a sewer access charge repayment program. We uh, wanted to provide some flexibility to residents in those area and anyone else that would be in a similar situation, so we provided some funding options to put it on their taxes and that sort of thing and pay it back a little bit over over time rather than just a lump, fr lump sum upfront payment. Uh, next item of business was approving an ICM agreement. Um, these are special agreements for heavy waste users into our wastewater treatment uh, facility. We approved that with Austin Tank Wash on 11th Street Northeast. We also approved um, using a facilitator for a council retreat on March 9th. Council approved that item moving forward and then the other items on the agenda were approval of our base pay schedule. That's an entire pay plan for the city and all city employees, a structure that's internally balanced and uh, compared against the private market. Um, council approved the base pay, pay plan on a six to one vote. We also had a contract with LELS, which is Law Enforcement Labor Services, which represents our patrol division of the police department. Council approved that labor contract uh, that's been signed by the union stewards and approved by their um, their bargaining group. Uh, we also set the wages for the city attorney and that rounded out the uh, council agenda. If you have questions on any of these items, sure would love to hear from you. Uh, shoot me an email, craigc at ci.austin.mn.us or always feel free to give me a call at 437-9941. Thanks so much.